Hi YouTube, my name's Drew and you're watching Drew's Obsessions. Back today with my morning smoothie. I'm trying to keep the nutrients in this uh, bad boy right here. And uh, I'm about to give you a little bit of a beard update. As you can see, I'm looking quite greasy today. That's because I haven't showered. I'm going to be uh, giving you an update on my beard. Then I'm going to be doing uh, a hair cut video uh, for my next video. So let me give you a little bit of a view of my beard at this point. It's, uh, again, I've slept on it. It's kind of matted. It's looking thick because it's so curly and kind of close to my face here. For the last month and a half or two months, I haven't done any trimming aside from just underneath my mustache here because uh, I just decided, you know what, I'm going to let it go. I'm going to really see uh, what the next level of bearding is. What I've been doing is this part here is curling out. I mentioned that in one of my previous videos. It just kind of curls out and looks weird because it kind of jets away from my neck. Uh, so I've been trimming this back, but then once I've trimmed it back, then it kind of seems to take away from the overall girth of the, of the beard and uh, it doesn't seem to go anywhere. I really want it to get bigger, longer, so I've just been letting it go. So let's check it out now and uh, as you can see, I'll just kind of fluff it out. This is uh, very, it's very dry and coarse at the, at the moment. And uh, I don't know, I've, I have noticed that in the last month and a half, it hasn't gotten that much bigger. I was expecting it to be quite a lot longer, um, especially with no trimming, but really it hasn't, hasn't done anything too crazy here. No crazy gains yet. Talk about them beard gains. You gotta make gains. Anyway, here it is. It's, uh, it's looking fuller, it's looking thicker because again, it's coarse, it's, uh, it's getting longer, it's getting all tangled and intertwined. What I'll do now is I'll just kind of fluff it out. I'll, uh, I'll wash it, I'll fluff it out, and then uh, I'll show you the results. Fluff it up for you here. I've got a freshly washed beard. I'm just uh, gonna comb out any knots that have occurred. And again, this is about seven months. It's, uh, I don't know, it's a little bit, I must say, I'm a little disappointed. I, I was hoping it to be a lot bigger than this. Again, I've been trimming it a little bit, but uh, nothing major. Let me know, how do your beards compare to this at se the seven month point? I mean, most people don't ever get to this point, and uh, I think if they do, they usually have quite a, quite a big beard, so. I mean, again, I, I do have issues growing beards. That's part of the reason why I'm, I've started this channel, to give you guys some tips and advice for what's working for me. Okay, so here it is all fluffed out. Looking very orange. So my problem area obviously is this part here and under here it grows a different direction. But again, you don't really notice it at this point. It's, so, it's kind of so big. And um, yeah, again, if I, if I fluff it out and it's clean, you can see through it. So it looks kind of weak. But when you've combed it down and you've used your beard oil, it's not so bad. Give myself a comb, comb it down all in one direction. Man, I love my beard. And there you have it. Uh, you know, it's it's looking good. It's it's uh, it's big. It's bushy. It's soft. I've been taking care of it. Uh, this is as best as I can do. I mean, some people are, are born with the gift of growing a beard, and some people can't. So I'm kind of I say in the middle there, and it's improving. But uh, you know, if you're one of those people who are always asking questions like, uh, "Will it grow? Will it grow?" This kind of stuff, you got to give it time. Just eat right. You know, try to limit stress, and uh, it'll come. It'll come. So thanks for watching and make sure to stay tuned to see how I shave and trim this hair in my next video. Thanks for watching.